How's it going, guys? We're here with uh, Mr. Morrison, and we're going to interview him, and we have a surprise for for him. Uh, Mr. Morrison, you were Teacher of the Month. Oh my gosh! Wow, thank you. What an honor. No problem. You actually had like a thousand votes, surprisingly, which is pretty crazy. Um, so congrats on that. And uh, we just have a couple questions, maybe like five. Okay. And then uh, we'll be out of your hair. Um, when and why did you decide to be a teacher? Um, well, I was uh, I was on my way to going to veterinary school. I was accepted into the University of Illinois, uh, but I decided that uh, four to six more years of school and hundreds of thousands of dollars worth of uh, uh, just uh, loans wasn't going to be right for me. And my my second love was always uh, teaching and teaching science. Well, there you go. Um, did you have any inspire like did something like spark you to be? Any, anything specific? Well, I had a number of people, uh, teachers, uh, in college and, and high school, but even when I was in grade school, I had a number of teachers who uh, lived in the area who helped me out, and uh, I always thought it would be something uh, fun and fulfilling to do. Awesome. So uh, what is the best part of your job? Oh, just working with students one-on-one, uh, -on -one, just uh, kind of uh, helping them understand something that they didn't understand before. Worst part? Worst part, I, I think just the the long hours of grading and the time spent away from my family while I'm at home. Alrighty, um, so uh, just a couple of fun questions, I guess. Um, what's uh, something that no one knows about you? Wow, I don't know. I guess maybe that. Uh, I used to be a nightmare of a student in grade school. I got in trouble. I got sent to the principal's office, and uh, I was just misunderstood. I think. So. So, do you have any hobbies outside of school? Um, just hiking and running and biking and walking my dog and uh, uh, all sorts of outdoor activities. Cool. Um, that's Mr. Morrison. That's all the questions we have. So uh, congrats again, Mr. Morrison. And you can see this on HiFiNews.com.